For 35 years, the Nisswa Women's Club has been raising funds for local scholarships by walking down the runway. Sarah Winkleman has the details of the annual fashion show. Paired with a lightweight, long white cardigan, this completes your look and is easy to layer. Minnesota is in full bloom as models go down the runway in the latest spring styles. We can get rid of our winter paraphernalia and bring out the summer clothes. This spring, the effort to help the community is in style. All of the money that we raise, whether it's from our grand prize raffle, the bucket raffle, the medallions or lanyards, all goes towards scholarships. The funds raised will help students from Brainerd and Pequot Lakes High Schools receive scholarships to further their education. And it just really was really nice just to see these worthy students receiving the scholarships so that they can go on and make a difference in their life. However, today's lesson was all about giving some fashion advice. A lot of new fashions showing. We have 13 merchants uh, participating this year and oh, tons of models with the latest fashions. And keeping it fashionably local. It's nice that they can come to a local place like Niswa to get clothes like this that are very stylish. Comfy, cool layers were common for models in today's show. Spring's arrived. We're here celebrating this great community and this great organization that's done so much and donated so many funds for great causes. With a long-standing tradition of making the community more fabulous. We're just excited to have everybody here. That's, it's, you know, you get to see old friends and, you know, lots of, lots of people from the community. A generous community that has given $112,000 over the last five years. We want to support the community, the, the high school kids and the college kids. It's a big reward for a short walk down the runway. Reporting in Brainerd, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. The scholarship money also helps non-traditional students at Central Lakes College. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.